your marriage, you stand within the charm circle of your love. And this is as it should be. But love is not meant to be the possession of two people alone. Rather, it would serve as a source of common energy, as a form in which you find the strength to live your lives with courage. From this day forward, you will come closer together than ever before. You must love one another in sickness and in health, for better and for worse. But at the same time, your love should be the strength to stand apart, to seek out your own unique destiny, to make your special contribution to the world, which is always a part of us and more than us. Love is one of life's highest experiences that we human beings can have. And it can add deep meaning to our lives. Love is one of life's greatest joys. When combined with friendship, both are intimately enhanced. Stefan, fun. <laughs> and Melissa, you met, and over time you have become best friends. And your hearts have grown towards one another. You are no longer two people living separately, but a couple traveling the path of life, life together. Today, you give yourself to other in marriage so that you can continue to share in each other's passion and triumphs. Remember that love and loyalty are the foundation on which a happy home is built. If the solemn vows that you are about to accept are kept, and if you steadfastly <coughs> endeavor to live your life honorably and with courage, the home that you establish will abide in peace, and your marriage will be everlasting. No other human ties are more tender, or vows more sacred, than those you are now about to pursue. Please face each other. There will come times in your life where days of there are days of sweetness and days of bitter sorrow. There will be celebrations. And there will be tears. There will be triumphs. And there will be tragedy. Life holds indescribable happiness in store for you both. And unavoidable pain as well. And so, to symbolize your acceptance of this reality, today we will share the bitter and the sweet, just as we'll share them for years to come. Take a taste. As you're eating it, I will recite this. Taste in it the dark days which will rock your marriage and test its strength. It, it represents disappointment, illness, and grief. Know that these hard times will come, and with them, the opportunity to deepen your bond as husband. Now you're each going to pour some crap into the single glass. And you will share wine from the single glass. You'll take and drink this sweet wine. Taste in it the sweetness and light that will fill your marriage with joy. Savor the fruits of this wine, just as you will savor every happiness that your beloved will bring.
today, Melissa and Stefan proclaim their love and commitment to their family and friends. And we gather here to rejoice with them and for them, for in the new life they will now undertake together as one. Stefan, please repeat after me. <clears throat> Melissa, I take you to be my lawfully wedded wife. Melissa, I take you to be my lawfully wedded wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better, for worse, for richer, for poorer. For better, for worse.
celebrating.